Welcome guys, we're here at the dugout on the Indianapolis west side. We're just going to take you through a quick little walkthrough and then we're going to do some Omnicat box openings. Hammer. Here's the cases. Lots of magic singles for you guys. He's got a foil case. Looks like a Planeswalker and Lands case. This is color, color coded cards. Sort it by color. Some sealed product on the back wall. Plenty of sealed product. Your supplies for your cards to protect them. Sleeves, play mats. This is a multicolored case. And this is West Side of Indy, one of our local gaming stores that we uh, play at. Yeah. All right, guys. Today we're gonna to be opening a box of Omnicat. See if we can get an intervention. And today it might be a little bit noisier than usual because we're at a local LGS. We're gonna give them a shout out. I mean, show them the, the store. The dugout. Oh, these are invocations, not interventions. Yeah, invocations. All right. Force of will or bust. Yeah. Uh, there's, there's a few good ones. Damnation's pretty good. I can't keep track of which one's which. What set takes what? Alright, let's see. Pack one. Pack one. We've got an insult. Alright. Let's go pack two. Pack two is a invocation. Oh, shit. And it's a good one. Pact of Negation. Pact of Negation, Invocation. Wow, Pact that's two. hot. And a Drake Haven. Mer. Can't complain about that on Man. Pact 2. I don't know if Pact 3 is a canyon. I don't know if this, uh, this box can get any hotter, man. <laughs> that was hot. Oh, so there's two box invocations. Man. Well, I'm, I'm starting off with the foils. The yeah, foil rare, right. new perspectives. Don't know what that's really worth or anything. Oh, and Oracle's Vault. Oh, we got another oh, one. Still the regular rare for the pack. And then the Oracle's Vault. There we go. Man. Pack two invocation. That's nice. Oh, non foil <laughs> new perspective. Yeah, might end up with a place that over. <laughs> Just what you need. Art Fiend. Yeah, to make the video kind of boring for everyone if they just wanted to see the invocation. Man, yeah. Well, at least we hit one. Sandworm Convergence. We got a Foil Plains. And then Channeler Initiate. Another foil, and that's a counter spell. It's just cancel, though. Not the counter spell invocation. This and is the blue player's box, though. Here's our first mythic coral reality. So we got a Thrasher Lizard foil and a Gideon of the Trials. Oh, next foil, back to back foils are mythics, mythics not yeah. foils. <laughs> All right. Cool. Uh oh, another foil. This card was seen a lot of play back when Amonkhet was in standard. Wayward Servant. Let's see what the rare in the pack is. Oh, Shelter Thicket. The lands, a little cycle lands. Throne of the God Pharaoh. We have another card that was played a lot in standard Approach of the Second Sun. Liliana's Mastery. We have a Honored Hydra as the rare in the pack. A Failure and Appear. <laughs> a failure and Comply. All right, another another mythic, and he's he's a hot boy, Hazard. 
or that might be, I think uh, Hazard's a female. Uh, who knows? I get confused. Irrigated farmland. There you go. That's another another cycle land. Fetchable cycle lands. We have prepared to fight as the rare. And a soul scar mage. Okay. We got rags to riches as the next rare. We got a mythic salmon voice of descent. Some loot. All right. Yeah, we got a plague belcher. And then the head of the worthy. Curator of Mysteries. I think without invocations, this is the most expensive card in the set at this point. Anointed Procession. Yeah. I think they're still holding around $20. That's a nice hit. We got Mouth to Feed. <laughs> That's a funny name for a card. Another mythic, Glorious oh. End. Uh, yeah. There you go. Take extra turn, lose the game. <laughs> <laughs> they, lost, they they did away with the regular end of turn, or take extra turns. Here for you cat fans, real caracal. Hapatro, Vizier of Poison. Well, not much more going. Let's see what we got here. Got another foil, a pouncing cheetah, and a Tamet Vizier and Nectone. Another back-to-back -back foil, Faith of the Devoted, and a Commit to Memory. That's seen a lot of play. We have never to return as the rare in the pack. Oh, we have a foil rare, Shadow of the Grave. Man, that's two foil rares. And Dread Wanderer. And a invocation in this box. Let's see what the last pack has in store for us. Throne of the God Pharaoh. Yeah, repeat rares. Yeah. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Remember, pack two, invocation. I don't think we could have been any more lucky. And we'll see you next time. Yep. Thank you. Yep. All right, we're going to do a second opening since we got an invocation in the last one. We're going to try to hit for two. Yeah, let's go back to back. Go ahead. Let's see what we get. Man, these boxes don't want me in it. If we get a pack. Must, must be something good in it. We get a pack two invocation. We're just gonna stop the video there and go home, right? Yeah, might as well. Let's <laughs> just end our day right there. All right, box number two of Almond Cat. We're at the dugout doing this. The local LGS around our area. All right. See what we get. Bounty of Luxo. Alright, pack one. Here goes pack two. Oh, foil approach to the second sun. That would have been hot and standard. And a prepare to fight. This is the non foil rare. We got an insult and injury. We've got a rag to riches. <laughs> Sweltering suns. Yeah, it's not starting off as good. No. Maybe it's going to be better at the end. That's building up uh, some steam, I guess. Uh, mount defeats the rare out of that pack. Got our first foil. It's a swamp. And harvest seasons. Oh man, just what we wanted. I remember back when the set was 
came out and opened like I think three or four foils of that thing. Here's another card that's seen some play in standard. Cut the ribbons. It's pretty good in standard fun. Yeah, Glyph Keeper. Uh, Yeah, not bad. Pull from tomorrow. Good EDH card. And a glory bringer. There we go. That was that was a real hot uh standard card. Everybody was playing glory bringer. There we have. Oh, we got a foil wasteland scorpion. And a chain wearing snake. Glory bound initiate. Oh, there we go. I like this card. Great EDH card. Crown support. Sir Park. And irrigated farmlands. There we go. Oh, Scatter Groves. Another cyclone land. And Archfiend of Ifner. We got a foil scaled behemoth and a Liliana's Mastery. A harsh mentor. He's seen a lot of play all around places. Nothing like too dominant, but he's just there. We got a dispossess. Got another foil, river serpent, and Tomet. <laughs> Here's a mythic, Liliana's Death Mas Master Street. Pretty good. A Gideon's Intervention. Yeah, Foil, impeccable timing, and we have another god, the catcher of the true. Limits of solidarity, foil, and failure to comply rare. Oh man, we hit the foil, now we got the non-foil approach of the second song. Man. And a sheltered thicket. Uh -oh. We're getting we're getting low and no invocations. We're not guaranteed one, so it's just a hope. There we go, the best cyclone land so far, the Fed Pools. And a canyon. I think that's what fifth cycle land? We have a combat celebrant. Or celebrant. A pretty good card. Another foil, hyena pack, and the rare sandworm conversion. All right, we're getting down to the final few packs. Uh, Drake Haven is the next rare in the pack. New perspectives. All right. Uh, we have a Chairman of the Pathion. And an Oracle's Vault. Alright, last pack here. This, this box has been uh, Invocation or Bust. Real lackluster compared to the first one. Uh, we have Hazard's Favor. I didn't even know this was a card. <laughs> and that's uh, all the packs. Uh, we have for this box as always guys share like comment subscribe and we'll see you next time see you on the next one